So here we are. Here's my nips, if you're interested. <laughs> Spencer, too hot for you. <laughs> 5.20 a.m. and John and I, hi John, what's up? We out here trying to catch sunrise at the Goldstream Trestle. It's still pitch black out, check this out. So we got a ton of time, which is nice. Neither of us have been up there for sunrise. No. Nope. Nope. So uh, I'm not sure of the views or anything, but I'm sure we'll make it work. All right? Get up there. We brought some smoke with us. Gonna try and work with that. Got the drone. Get that up in the air. And yeah, we're just gonna have some fun. See mm -hmm. you guys up there. Wow. Okay, we made it after the longest hike ever. What's up? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Finally. <laughs> you guys can barely see us right now, but. Uh, we're about 10 minutes out from sunrise on top of the trestle. You guys can't see it that well, but I'll show you some other footage once we get it. And uh, yeah, now comes the setup and waiting for it. But it's pretty nice. We can see some like nice details up in the clouds so far. Mount Finlayson is right across over there. And uh, yeah, we're going to see what we can do. had the drone up in the air we couldn't really see anything because it's still too dark um, but it started raining pretty big drops and you can see the stuff is getting pretty wet so we just packed up the gear and we'll just be hiding under the trees for a bit hopefully um, it won't be raining for too long um, yeah hopefully it'll just rain for a bit and we can come back out because we still got other things to plan. Still haven't even brought up the camera yet. Um, also, I don't know what's going on with the white balance on this action cam. I haven't even tried to check it or change it or set it yet. But right now it's looking awfully blue. So it might cause some issues later for color grading, but I don't know, we'll find out. We left Ellie out here. Say hi, Ellie. Ellie, say hi. <laughs> He's a happy dog now. Poor guy was um, too scared to cross the trestle. <laughs> Scaredy cat. Um, but yeah, we're just going to find some place to chill under some trees and stay dry. Uh, should we just go over on this side? Yeah. Which is nice and I'm thankful for that so we're gonna try and take some uh, footage now I'm gonna pop some smokes the trestle actually looks pretty decent now the wood is all darker because it's wet I kind of like that it's kind of nice looks like it's all stained or something uh, let's see the Sun is over there I don't know it's hard to see the Sun uh, we still can't figure out where the Sun's coming up we hate we even have a compass but we're like oh which way is east which way is west we don't know
And take a look. Okay. Ready? Yep. Okay, whatever. Fuck, I lost focus. Yeah, hopefully I got some. I burned my thumb. That's fine. Took some blurry ones. Oh, oh but I got some good ones though. Did you? Yeah. At this point, we tried to get some video of John with the smoke using the drone and the DJI action. But what we didn't realize is we were about to have a major fail. And that fail was because our third and final smoke grenade that we took up with us didn't actually work. We're not exactly sure why, but we think it's just because it's so old. It's been sitting in my in my garage for so long. So as you can see here, when he goes to pull the pin, and when he finally pulls it out, it doesn't actually ignite. It kind of surprises us both, but I guess that's how it goes. This was a test concept after all, and we really couldn't expect it to go perfectly. But considering what happened, we are both really happy with it on our way back down and i'm definitely feeling this in my knees specifically my right it band so if anybody's watching this and you know how to resolve it band issues hit me up leave a comment let me know how to get rid of that because it sucks i'm really starting to feel my age here not that i'm super old but i'm not as young as i used to be Ugh. We, uh, we had a good time up there. It was a lot of fun. Something's going on with the drone though. It, it seems like um, the props are pulsing. So I might um, send that off to DJI and get it taken care of. I'm not sure yet, but we didn't want to use it too much. Um, and then when we had everything set up and ready to go, we had all our slow mo cams ready to go for that last smoke. The thing was broken. <laughs> it didn't work. Uh, Whatever. We got some, uh, I think we got at least a couple good pictures um, from the first couple smokes that we used. And because it was like our first time, whoops, I almost died right there. Because it was our first time doing it, um, it was like a, a preview or a trial anyways. And I think that went pretty well. Turns out that John is actually a pretty decent model and uh half and a half decent photographer <laughs> so we did pretty well happy with that uh yeah we're just going to continue the climb down now i don't know how much more i'm going to be doing today because my knee is just about shot well specifically my it band like i said if you guys know how to fix that it band issue hit me up and let me know all right and that was pretty much it that was our day uh, we got up there, we tried some new things, it was a lot of fun. The smoke idea was a really cool concept and I think we have a lot of cool ideas for when we go out next. And we're already starting to plan that so stay tuned for, for um, what we're going to come up with. Also we came up with only a couple pictures this time because like I said we were just trying to test it and see what it's going to be like, how we're going to react to the smoke, how the smoke reacts to being popped and all that kind of stuff right so um here are the pictures that we got for the day this one is the one that john took of me this is the one i took of john um you can let us know in the comments who you think did a better job we have to cut him a break though because he did borrow my camera to take that picture so he wasn't used to uh the settings i usually shoot in full manual he usually shoots in auto um but he did pretty good and it was a lot of fun and i'm definitely looking forward to shooting more with him uh, yeah, so that's it guys. So if you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, comment, share with your friends. 
Let us know what kind of videos you'd like to see next. Uh, I think John and I are thinking about even doing photographer challenges as time goes. We'll see how it goes. But um, yeah, it was fun. And we'll see you guys next time.